there, welcome to this session, The Detective Archetype, accessing your ability to always be five steps ahead, even if self-doubt is your best friend. You think life would be fine if you could judge everything or nearly everything accurately. You would then know what would make life easy and you'd be less anxious about risks. The trouble is, you get some things bang on right and you completely miss others. So you can never really be sure when you can be completely confident in your calculations. The truth is, you're perfectly capable. You just want confidence in your instincts. You want to discern situations rather than feel oversensitive or overwhelmed. And when you have this, you find it's easy to connect with great people. And more importantly, you then know who to trust. You then fast become, very fast become, the person that others trust for your opinion because they know, they know that you've weighed everything up and what you say has a kind of confidence to it. So what's the issue? The real issue isn't that you haven't the skills. The real issue is your conflict between instinct and self-doubt. And when you allow your instinct, even when you doubt yourself, you reach truth. But there is something in your way. The detective archetype you are familiar with is the times you've searched out answers and you found them. It's those times you felt inspired, curious, and determined, able to see life clearly. Then, one day, you didn't get it spot on. Clouded by doubt, you stepped back from yourself. You stopped exploring. You switched off your curiosity and allowed panic to set in. What if I'm humiliated? Thundered through your mind. The detective archetype shows up to show you your conflict between instinct and avoidance. The path of insecurity trying to control reality. The journey of the archetype, detective archetype begins with knowing when to react and when to wait. And it does that with presenting confusion, a place where you feel scatty and indecisive to then reveal a new space within, one of clarity and knowing what's next. For magic to happen in life, it requires stability across all emotions. No one can become a master of consciousness without taking the journey from rejection to acceptance. And the detective shows you that through the energy of discovery. And now it's time for you to continue that move to mastery within emotion and realize it's not about hiding, it's about that call to adventure. And you do that by taking the first step on the detective's healing path, which of course takes us on to the next subject.